very thing that I was going to have a hysterectomy for, I had these handful of symptoms that I had been dealing with that were really a problem in my life and they were going away. Hi, my name is Heather Casey. I wanted to share my Inside Tracker story. So my journey with um, how I found Inside Tracker started years ago, because I am a coach, I coach triathletes and cyclists, and I'd actually been recommending Inside Tracker to my clients for a long time, but I had not tried it myself, which seems odd, I know. But in March of 2022, I had decided with a doctor that it was time for me to face some challenges that I had been dealing with with my women's health for about five years. And it was recommended that I have a hysterectomy. And I really, I, I didn't want to have to face this choice, but honestly, some of the symptoms I had been dealing with, it was the only thing that we hadn't exhausted. We had tried medications, we had tried all kinds of things, except a natural approach, and I'll get to that. But back to this decision um, with my doctor to have a hysterectomy, I was approved by my insurance company and we were moving forward. So now let's back up a little bit in time. My parents were both in the medical workplace. My dad was an internal medicine doctor. And when he was alive, I remember him sharing with his patients that if you're facing something like surgery, that is a major procedure, that um, he would always recommend that people get in the best shape of their life that they could before the surgery so that their bodies could handle anesthesia and the whole recovery process better. And so the surgery of a hysterectomy was not something I was looking forward to. I did not want to have to face all of the downtime, but I knew that it was what I needed. And so I heard that voice of my dad telling me to get in the best shape of my life possible before the surgery. And so I decided to use Inside Tracker to get blood work done and make any changes then before surgery so that that was my version of say you know doing a little investigating to get in the best shape possible before surgery and so i ordered my inside tracker test and then when i got the results back i was actually a little bit surprised because i've been a lifelong athlete i considered myself to be very very healthy eat clean foods but there were some things that quite honestly just it was a wake-up call i saw that my liver enzymes were a little bit high and my blood glucose level was high and there were a few other things and so i decided that i would use the inside tracker app and all of the guidance available to me and i would follow everything 100 percent on the inside tracker act app that was recommended and so every day I could log on to the app and see what my lifestyle choices were what the supplements recommended and some of the lifestyle things were removing alcohol removing processed sugars and so I adhered 100% and after two weeks my symptoms started to go away the very thing that I was going to have a hysterectomy for, I had these handful of symptoms that I had been dealing with that were really a problem in my life and they were going away. <laughs> I waited a little bit longer. I was like, okay, the, so these symptoms have come and gone before. And then after a month, I was now like in an in-between time where um, originally when I got the lab work done, I was two months ahead of my planned surgery. And now at this point, I was in this in-between time. I was one month away from my surgery and I wasn't having, experiencing any of my symptoms anymore. I was keeping daily notes in my Training Peaks account of how I was feeling, symptoms I was experiencing, time frames, and I was seeing that this has been a month and I haven't had anything. So I um, called the doctor's office and I said, I explained everything to them, what I did with Inside Tracker, the changes that I made, and they said, well, you know, you still should come in for your pre-op and talk to the doctor. So I went into the pre-op. I actually broke down in tears in the doctor's office because I didn't want surgery. I mean, I really did not want to have surgery. I, you know, I saw, I shared, I said, everything that I've changed, 
Um, I quit drinking, I removed sugar, I've done some other things, and I'm not experiencing any of these symptoms anymore. And they said, okay, you, you, your insurance has approved the surgery. You don't have to have surgery right now, but we'll probably see you back um, because these kinds of things don't just go away. And um, so I was on one hand very pleased because I was leaving the doctor's office no longer scheduled for surgery in June of 2022, but also really wasn't feeling supported by my medical professionals. And, and so I left and they were expecting to hear back from me, I'm sure. Um, now we are almost a full year later and I'm still symptom free. I'm still following all of the recommendations in Inside Tracker and living my healthiest life possible. My body composition has changed tremendously um, for the better. I've added lean muscle. Some body fat that I was just hanging on to has really gone away without much more effort other than changing my lifestyles. My blood sugar was shifting. I was feeling some swings during the day and that's no longer happening. And then the most serious side effects that I was having were related to my women's health and they're gone. And so I now continue to recommend Inside Tracker to all of my clients, both athletes and non-athletes, because there are so many things that we can identify through optimizing our health through Inside Tracker remembering that the American Medical Association is only making recommendations to prevent disease when we get our lab works done. And so it's been a life changer for me and I could not recommend it enough. Thank you.